Okay, I can't even zipper this. Okay. I was going to zipper this for the vlog, but I can't even do Okay. No. Morning, family. Oh, please be a focus. Please be a focus. Please be a focus. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, welcome to vlog. It's day four. It, I see this every year, but it's flying by. Does it feel like it's flying by already for you guys? Day four. It is 6 a.m. Um, I'm feeling a little better. I didn't know if this trip was going to happen for a couple of reasons, but I'm alive. Thank God. Um, also, day four, second giveaway over my Patreon. Help that family. Let's get $1,000. Go win a Christmas card for me. And today's a pretty, this one's a pretty good giveaway. So just link in the description, sign up for Patreon. Anything, dollar, two dollars, whatever. Go hang out with us. Um, oh, um, Liam's right here. We're headed to Seattle to see my friend Brianna. Remember Brianna? She used to live in China. She lives in Halifax now with her husband, John. They're done their China, I think it was eight years. But John is from Seattle. They're here for, they came for American Thanksgiving. It took them 38 hours to get there because Halifax had a huge storm. Anyway, we're going, me, Liam. Have you met Liam's partner, Alicia? We're all going down to Seattle. Uh, just to see them for two days, so. Okay, I get it. It's super early. But, like, why would you not want to wake up every morning to see that? It's cold. But it's so pretty. And it's so quiet. That's why I love getting up so early. Every sunrise. It's so pretty. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Do you know that I'm doing Vlogmas? Do you know what that oh, is? I started, yeah, you did the last year. It's actually day four for Vlogmas. So you'd say, happy day four of Vlogmas. Right now? Yeah. <laughs> happy day four of Vlogmas. <laughs> you did great. I'm famous now. You are. Crazy. You did great, Alicia. I tried. You did great. So Liam and Alicia are going to take me to a vegan cafe for brunch? Breakfast? Brunch? Oh, <laughs> we, we don't live here? I have cash. Here's to a family vacation. Your beer looks, it's hazy. It looks yeah, it's really good. Tofu scramble, gravy. How is that? Okay, I want to try. Yes, you have to. Oh, I have, I've touched both, so they have to be mine. Oh, I love ranch. That's really Whoa. Good. Really good. That is so good. Oh, mama life. Yeah? Look at that. How is that vegan? I don't understand. Dude, how is this vegan? How is this yeah. Can I have that, that pickle? Do you like pickles? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I do have to say the Wayward is a Wayward Cafe. Mm -hmm. Yep. That is the best vegan place I've ever had. Really? In my really? Life. Oh. And I've I've been to I want at least 30 vegan spots. Happy to Just purely vegan. So good. Spots. 
glad we can help you out, Willow. I well, like best vegan food that I've had for like overall, like because there was like five pages. You can have breakfast, lunch, or dinner, and like they have everything. Like there wasn't something like they were like really missing. Yeah. Probably best vegan food that I've had though that was like prestige, like is maybe the acorn on Main Street that I could recommend. It's like a very like three course fancy meal. It was good, but yeah, I can't believe how good that's all oh, that chick that sandwich you got, Alicia. I would get again. Like I would get. Yeah, that was good, and it was big too. It was so only big, like, and it was cheap. It was so cheap. Even like with that. the Canadian dollar, like that's still cheap. Yeah. And that ranch, oh, that ranch, ranch is so good. Is so good. Anyway, that was our um, American Thanksgiving. Does anyone have an offline map? All right, all right. Just here at local Al's market. Mike's beer garden next door. Mike's is it Mike's beer garden? Yeah, we're in Olala. Beer garden and Al's as well. I'm excited. Oh, I want to get a jug. A growler? Yeah. Oh, what are they called? Yeah. Oh, we should get a book. That's yeah, pretty cool. It's like a same, we went home. same place. That's so cool. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it was pretty good. It's called Angel of Swallow. That's so crazy. What should we bring for the party? It's good. Hey, look at these big white claws. <laughs> I should just got those. Yeah, you should. I try to find the mm. lowest alcohol <laughs> beer. I don't want to get too fucked up. <laughs> What's it called? Prism. Uh, Ooh. prismatic. Rude parrot. Rude parrot, and I got. Oh, and then I also premium. <laughs> oh, you also got what yeah. is that? Hack and spa I mean, pack and <laughs> alpaca. When I went to Walmart, I got the kids that for that family I adopted. I bought a tur uh, what's that thing called? A uh, transformer for him. I got this Disney game. Yeah, and no, then... but I'm gonna test it out with a white claw. Oh, in its yeah, mouth, yeah, put it in this. It's gonna spray a, a white oh. claw in my mouth. <laughs> okay, do it. Well, I also got a thing of white claws because we don't have them in Canada and they're really big here in, in the States, I guess. I don't know. Okay, and this one, Best Brewery. I'm excited, guys. That's gonna be good. Now we're gonna have a beer in this convenience store. This is gonna be the best day of our lives. Look at how pretty, look at that view, though. Yeah, it's a beautiful one. Uh, You're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> and there? I thought you know. Thanks guys, thanks fam. Do I have it? I'm always like Do you take beer? And now we're going to Mike's and now we go to the beer garden. Thank you. Oh, this is so warm. This is dope. Cool. Brianna, you haven't been on the vlog in a long time. Uh, no, I haven't. I was trying to explain to them before I was like leaving. I'm like, Brianna lives in Halifax now, I know, right? not China, with her husband John. But now they're in Seattle. Do you need a hat? Um, so, um, John, I don't know how to open this. Oh, uh, Brianna's husband. Okay. Update. We're going to Starvation Heights. Hey, Duff, lights Somebody's up. Jamming something. Right. Oh, no, 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 we can't go up any farther. Lights Why? up. What is this? Yeah. See the no. trees? It's already a ghost. Fuck off. Oh. Yeah, it looks That's like a ghost came out. Wait, dude, we're going to die. I'm going to die. Wait, look, he's here. John, you're going to get hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, John! Just be quiet, though, so no one calls the police. I don't think we should go. No, but I don't think we should stay either. We're just here. Someone can get us out of here. 
Should we stay as a group? I'm staying. I'm fucking staying. Just okay. come out for a little bit. And then <laughs> come out for a little bit. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, is that it? Oh, you're not. We're not going to be able to see that. I'll try to pull it. Are you guys in the house already? We didn't even lock the door. Someone can come get us. You want to lock it? Yeah, but we also need this light on. Will it stay on? I think if you do, on. Okay. Okay, I didn't explain where we are, but we're at Starvation Heights, which is like a really <laughs> haunted place here in Olala, Washington. It's like up the road from John's home. And you can go into it. I'm gonna have to explain what it is, but this woman would have people here. And she would like, they were sick people. She said she was a doctor. She was a doctor, but she would kill them solely, right? She would starve them. Starve them, yeah. So that's why they called it Starvation Heights. There's like books and movies about it, right? And it's super, super haunted. Now it's just abandoned, but it's still super haunted. Like people like, like, I think it was on like a paranormal thing. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, look, Brianna and I stayed in here because you guys know I don't fuck with that shit at all. Do not. So they're in a haunted house and they wouldn't take my camera, which I don't claim them, so. It. They're upstairs, I can see them. I, the problem is it's really low light and you can't see anything. See you can see their flashlight up there, see? How did they get inside? Oh, the door is open. What? <laughs> Why wouldn't someone lock that? I don't know. There's a garage that's fucking creepy as fuck. I'm glad there's no door on it though. Also, my camera's not really working here, so this could be paranormal activity. Like everything's just blurred. It's super so weird. Loud. All right, since I didn't really explain this that well, so Linda Hazard um, she nicknamed the starvation a doctor. So she had, she was known for kind of this fasting, um, but what it was is actually she was starving these people and then taking over their, all their like, pretty much everything they owned, all their money. Um, yeah, she was responsible for at least 15 deaths. It's actually, they're pretty sure it's a lot more because they didn't catch on to her very fast and she was burying them in that place we were at. Ola, right? Yep. In the Wilderness Heights in Olala. Fasted for days, weeks, and months on a diet of small amounts of tomato and asparagus juice. A small teaspoon of orange juice. Well, some patients survived. Dozens died under her care yeah anyway you can read it all up it's pretty creepy and there's two books on this whole thing and everything Ugh. um yeah. we found out this woman was like killing a bunch of people she would bury their bodies somewhere else they tore down the actual place Oh, they did tear down the That's what John was saying up, up there. Oh, that makes sense. Because I was like, I'm pretty sure this was like in the early 90s. It was way bigger. But then, 19. I don't know if this was the house, but like where she actually did kill the people and like did her procedures, they tried to sell that and they sold it to a woman and she had children and they, they said like, because the bathroom was where she did it, they oh. could hear screams and cries <clears throat> from the bathroom. Nope, screw that. Fuck no. Anyway, come on guys. I like listening to podcasts and stuff about that, but do I like to visit them? Nope. nope. I don't know if you know this, but um, my friend Elena has a haunted doll, and she makes you do videos with it, and it's really fucked up. She's a haunted doll? Yeah. What does it do? Oh. There's, like, videos, like, proof of it and stuff. Like, yeah. it's actually haunted. Like, I, I kind of have to stop It's like an her. old doll? Yeah, she got it off this lady. Why did she, did she know it was haunted? When yeah, she, she wanted it? to do it. She's like, let's try this out, because she is a skeptic. But, like, oh. this doll is straight up haunted. Cool. Was it cool? Yeah. Was it scary? Go in? No. It really wasn't really that scary at all. Like, Dude, you better in. fucking go in. Dude. No, I'm not going in. Willow, do you want me to take you in for like a quick second? No, I'm not fucking with yeah, that. No. It is kind of scary. scary. But it's like, yeah, come on, it just in. come in, dude. Yeah, no, you can take it in. Just come in. I'll protect you. Take it in. Okay. We'll I'll take it's it in. It's recording. It's fun. Okay, you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dang. Dang, bright phone. What's up? What's up? Dang, bright phone.
It looks freshly wet. <laughs> what is that, bro? That's what the actual host, they tore that down, right? They tore down the actual oh. house. That house was like the house when like the families would come get them <gasps> and they would dress them up real nice and get them like all prepared to leave. Like that house. dressed you what? that you, John. So that wasn't the house they stayed at. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, you motherfucker. Oh, no, they stayed in there too. Like they didn't live in that hey, house. But they stayed there. Can but did she kill friend? anybody hey. in that house? Finally back home in Canada, across the border. Wasn't that bad. Um, very quick trip to Washington, Seattle, Olala. And actually we just, we went to Tacoma for today. Love Tacoma. Um, we got a great vegan meal. Viva, I think, V-I-V-A. Highly recommend, I'll put some pictures here. All the vegan food and the desserts. I ended up getting vegan cheesecake because I was so full but I had to do it. Highly recommend. I ended up actually getting a couple little things there because I love all the shops. Definitely want to go back. And then we also stopped in Bellingham. Had to hit up Trader Joe's. Um, did all the American things. Had an amazing time with Brianna and John and John's family. They always make me feel welcome. They always make me feel a part of the family. I'm just so grateful. It's been really hard. Brianna's one of my best friends and I'm lucky to see her once a year too. And I'm just grateful that I got to see her this weekend. Very short but sweet. Um, yeah, some really good people in my life. Uh, I love Washington. I really, really do. Um, I'm glad I got to go down there. I'm also so grateful that I can get to another country. I can get to Washington in two hours. Like, it's so crazy. Heights. I'll put as much information here or some links below about Starvation Heights. But this woman, this doctor, was bringing people... Like they were getting them to like, I think, f like fast and not eat to like heal them, make them better. But what she was doing is make them super sick and getting them to sign all their stuff and all their valuable possessions to her. So she was a fraud. She was killing all these people. And that place, which is up the street from John's house, Starvation Heights, is it's crazy haunted. Um, and so that's where we went to last night. Um... And I didn't go in the house because I just, I can't. The big house, like, where they actually, like, kept all of the people. Like, I forget what it's called. It's, like, almost, like, it was huge. They tore that down finally. But, yeah, they, it's really, really haunted. I'll put some links here so you can read about it. Elena and Anne, I can go there one day. But don't, I don't mess with that. You guys know that. Um, anyways, that was Vlogmas Day 4. Count. Thank you so very much. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. Please give it a like and share this. Anyway, thank you so much. Uh, for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow.